Yahoo YouTube, I am Super Yankee, and this is another weekly coronavirus update. It has now been confirmed that there are over a hundred thousand confirmed cases of coronavirus around the world. I'm getting these statistics from worldmeter.info slash coronavirus online. You can check a live meter of worldwide coronavirus cases on this website. Now, it's important to note that this number is grossly underestimated because many of the nations that have had the largest outbreaks of coronavirus have been under-reporting their numbers for economic reasons to not stymie investors away from investing in those countries. And I understand this, but I mean, what I want you guys to take, as always, is away from these videos is start preparing for pandemic mode thinking right now because this virus does not grow linearly, linearly, it grows exponentially. And exponential growth means that the numbers that we're seeing today don't, aren't relevant to the numbers last week and are not going to be relevant to the numbers next week. Now I want to read to you some of the numbers coming out from this website because I think they're important. Iran, which is a new sub which is a new hub in the Middle East, reported an increase of 1,234 cases today, which brings up their total case number to 4,747 cases. Spain, which is where I live, reported an increase of 100 cases today, which brings up their case total to 382 cases. And I mean, ugh, I have opinions about this, but let's just keep reading the numbers. Japan, which is one of the countries that is reportedly underreporting the number of coronavirus cases, and it's the country that I lived in, is reporting an, an addition of 17 cases today, which brings up their total case number to 382, 81 cases, which puts them one below Spain, which I think is E. The USA, which is where I've lived my whole life, is reporting 233 cases today, confirmed, with an addition of 12 cases and then Norway, which I'm looking to go to later this month, is reporting 108 cases, an increase of 14 cases just this day. Now again, what I want you to take away from these videos more than anything is that this, this virus is already gone, world pandemic mode. Like, there's over 40 to 50 countries that have coronavirus present in them to date. And this number is only going to increase because the virus has an exponential growth rate. And that means, like I said before, that today is not relevant to last week, is not relevant to next week. Because we just don't know how much it's going to spiral out of control. And there's really no way to stop it from growing at this point. It is broken containment meaning that it is now outside of China. It has been outside of China for quite a while. And the only thing that we can really do about the virus is prepare, start stocking up on canned goods, shelf life food, and water because we might have to stay in our houses. I actually heard from a friend of mine that his Japanese son, not his Japanese son, his friend's Japanese son who lives in Wuhan has literally been locked in their house for six weeks only leaving about three separate times to buy food and water. Now, let me just say this. The virus is not what's going to kill you, most likely. There is a lower mortality rate than some other things, especially if you live in a country that has an infrastructure with a good medical apparatus. Panic is probably going to be the most dangerous thing that would happen when this virus takes hold in your country and god forbid in your neighborhood and the best thing you can do right now is start preparing for the inevitable and continuing to take control of what is actually in your control and that's your view your desire to not have to start preparing for pandemic thinking when the pandemic actually hits anyway youtube that's your weekly coronavirus update i'm super genki thank you for watching if you like this video, don't forget to share it with your friends. We need to spread awareness and spread positivity in this in this video, meaning that we need to spread just taking action to actually act towards the inevitable. Leave a like, leave a comment. I'd love to respond to your comments. Ask me some more questions. But most importantly, just keep watching these videos because you know this is a journey. 
And if you're watching these videos, you're a part of my journey, I'm a part of your journey, and we can really help each other out. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.